Hey, everybody. It's Joe and Dr. Ennis here from Ennis Hello. Chiropractic. And we wanted to take just a minute and talk about a subject that is something that we actually see a lot of in our office in particular. Uh, and that is folks who are dealing with vertigo. So vertigo is a really interesting subject because not many people who don't have it have any clue what it is. <laughs> it's, it's, it's almost seems like, um, and actually a lot of patients that come and say this, that, that the friends and family and coworkers and colleagues that they know almost look at it like it's a get out of social activity free card, right? That it's, it's just an excuse to not have to do things. And, you know, for the people that deal with vertigo, <laughs> God, it's not that at all. I mean, it's truthfully, it's pretty insulting to think about it that way because, you know, this is an issue that truly does stop life in its tracks for the people that deal with it. You know, whether it's, you know, general nausea, dizziness, uh, just not being able to do the things that you want to do. And in some cases, not being able to really even sit up or stand. Uh, it's really a big problem. Uh, and, and we wanted to talk about it because, uh, well, it's, it truly is one of our areas of expertise. Uh, and speaking of expertise, it's not here. It's not with me, uh, it's with Dr. Ennis. So, so Doc, I'm going to be quiet for a minute. C can you talk a little bit more about why are people coming from all over the country? Why are they flying in? Uh, for our office to come in and spend time with you. What's different from what you're doing for folks who deal with vertigo than what they can get, you know, down the street at their local medical or traditional chiropractor's office? Well, that's, that's a really good question. You know, uh, we're an upper cervical specialist, so we deal with pressures at the brainstem and the spinal cord, which is right below the skull. There's a special bone called your atlas, and it affects not only the spinal cord, but pressures on uh, or flow of the cerebral spinal fluid, which causes pressures into the skull. Mm -hmm. And those things combined um, tend to cause big problems with vertigo. And, uh, and so, so most traditional uh, chiropractic offices really don't address this particular issue. Uh, medical offices were really confined to medications, um, which most of the time don't work or they're temporary at best. And, mm -hmm. or they're, they're forced to do an epile maneuvers or some kind of weird things that don't have any really lasting effect. And what we're looking for is, why is that riding reflex, that ability to, to keep yourself uh, planted, why isn't that working right? And it turns out at the base of the skull, there's a portion of the nervous system that tends to be involved with that. So, so our specialty, we, we focus on that. And it's, it's one of the reasons why we're uh, specialists in, the, in this particular re this realm. And we have people driving from or flying from all sorts of the parts of the country just for this particular type of care. And I'll tell you, it's a, it's a really scary thing because it's a life changer. Um, um, vertigo affects, it, even in mild cases, it's a sense of unease. Is it going to hit while I'm driving or, you know, clumsiness sure. or things like that? It's really sense, it affects them psychologically. It's been there for a long time. And in extreme cases, Joe, it's, uh, they can't leave the house. It, pretty much they're stuck. And, and that's uh, not a way to live your life for sure. Sure. Yeah, it, it's such an interesting situation because to the people that deal with it, it's it, it consumes everything, right? I mean, it it, it dictates right. their social. You know, can you make it to work today? Can you go out and celebrate with this person? And um, you're you're always having to account for it, right? Yeah, they wake up wondering if the world's going to be spinning or if they're going to throw up when they when they move. It's really the deal. How awful. Yeah, and. And so this is something that you've really niched yourself out into in terms of specialty, because I know we see a tremendous amount of folks that are coming in with vertigo issues. Yeah, we do. It really is. It's been uh, quite a specialty for us. And, um, and we've had a pretty good success rate with it, actually, to be honest with you. And I uh, feel pretty privileged, actually, to serve them with that. So. so when I think of chiropractic care, because we're chiropractic office, yeah. um, it, it, obviously, I have some experience with it myself. Yeah. So. Uh, I, I have some of the the, uh, the issues out there demystified, but a lot of people, I'm thinking they're thinking, when I'm thinking of a chiropractor, you know, it's clean and jerk, right. it's elbow to the back, you know, jumping right. off the top rope, kind of move. WWF moves, yeah, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, quite a bit. Um, that's that's not the experience that that you're providing, folks, is no, it? It's not in the upper area, in the upper part of the spine. It's unique. Uh, the architecture and the biomechanics of the spine work different. And so it requires a high level of specificity. It requires um, an analysis that's not ordinary variety. It's quite complicated. 
Mm -hmm. And it requires an adjustment that's super gentle and very specific. In fact, um, most people will describe it as just pressure. And it's obviously a little more than that, but there's no popping, jerking, yanking, or anything of that nature. And, and that's because it can't be. That area is very special and it requires a very gentle approach. So yeah, there's none of that medieval stuff, as they say. Gotcha. Yeah. So it's really gentle and, and very specific. And I know we've got quite a bit of equipment to make sure that, that we're, you know, th this isn't just a, a general, um, I, I, I think it'll work. We'll wait and see. I mean, this is, this is not like that at all. You're right. We're using a lot of data here, right? Yeah. It's only that we actually will measure, as you know, we measure the nervous system in, in several different ways before we even take a case on. But even more importantly with our NOCA work, we do very specialized, uh, what amounts to three-dimensional films of the atlas and the occiput and the skull. And then we do our, our correction. And then we do post films and remeasure again to make sure it's reduced like it's supposed to. So there's a lot that goes in that you won't see in really any other kind of chiropractic offices. It's uh, very specialized that way. And uh, uh, this way we know when we get that correction, we can measure it and see it. It's, uh, it's, a, it's the real deal. So if somebody's catches wind of this video and, and they're, they're learning more about your vertigo program, uh, what, what's the best next step for someone like that? Well, you know, the, the first step is, is to uh, contact our office. We hold a class twice a week on, um, on what we do and how we affect that. And I, and I do a lot of examples with vertigo and, and I have some neat case studies on that for them to, to kind of see. Uh, the step after that is if, if they find they're, they were right for them, then we do an exam to find out if it's really going to be a case we can take on. We look for pressure at the spinal cord. We have ways of measuring that. If that's present, then we start our, you know, our NUCA process. And if it's not, well, then we've eliminated one big negative and we can focus on some of the other, the other causes. But the nice thing about um, addressing this here is that if it is the upper cervical spine, which it is in a lot of the cases, we're addressing a cause. So it's not just a Band-Aid approach. It's about how can we fix you mm -hmm. and then show you how to keep it that way. So we're not having to you know, rely on a medication to falsely mask it up. And then when the meds wear off, all of a sudden you're back to the same boat, right? That's not the idea. We really want to fix this thing so that you can maintain it easily for the rest of your life. Gotcha. Well, well great. Hey, I, I appreciate that um, we we're able to kind of sneak away from some patients for a little bit and, uh, and record this. You know, as always, if you're watching any of our videos here from Ennis Chiropractic and you have questions related to the content, if you're looking for more information about the processes and procedures we're talking about, or if you just want to talk about your case in general, you know, uh, leave us a comment, go to the website, use the contact forms, give us a call, uh, you know, call us, call us by phone. Well, we have one of those it works quite well. And, you know, let us know. I mean, we're, we want to make sure that if this is an opportunity where we can help you, that we do so the right way and as quickly as possible. I mean, I can't imagine the, uh, you know, dealing with this and living with it, particularly in severe cases and not knowing where a solution is when we're here the whole time you know, looking out for those folks. So we're, we're currently accepting new vertigo patients right now. You know, we're, we're looking for some and uh, you can learn more about the screening process as well as our discovery classes uh, over at inniscaropractic.com, right? That's it, Joe. Thanks. I really appreciate it. Yep. Yeah. Any parting words? Yeah. I just uh, want to thank you so much. And for those people out there where the world's, where the world's not quite stable, there are some solutions and uh, we look forward to seeing you.